Hi guys, so in today's vlog, I'm going to try a protective style, like style these um, medium sized twists. So keep watching. So what I need is body pins, which I'm a slacker. I did not go to the store yesterday to get more body pins, but I know I'll need more than this. I have some little rubber bands that I use to put my shells on my hair, um, as well as some, some aloe vera. So I use this on my face and it doesn't have much um, build up because I've used it on uh, my edges before. So it's just a light something. Um, to kind of get any flyaways back. I don't want product to build up and I'm not sure how other gels work with um, the Misha Beauty product. So leave a comment down below if you know what gels work with them, what gels flake, what gels don't. I've, I haven't tried it before and I just don't want uh, flaky edges um, for this style. So, um, yeah, and I need my toothbrush for my little baby hairs. So this is my toothbrush that I use and I have a edge scarf from way, way, way back in the day. I love this thing. I think you can get them at like the beauty supply store, um, super cheap. So first I was looking on Pinterest to see what type of styles I can do. Um, I don't want a normal style. Um, but I saw some like bridal styles. And so the first thing that I'm going to do is, um, so they, they really sectioned off the front portion of your hair. And luckily I already sectioned it off myself. Um, so when I'm doing my twists, so I have it pre-sectioned anyway. And so I'm gonna use these. You don't have to use these, but I just wrap them around once to just get it out of the way. It doesn't snag my hair at all, but it's kind of like a tight, tight but loose hold. So these are the front sections. And then the back section, um, they just say to put it in a ponytail. And again, it's gonna be very loose. I don't want any tension on my hair. Then we're gonna start on this side. And I normally do this with um, my hair all the time. Listen, this is what we don't want to do. <laughs> I should have been more gentle. Um, but this is what I do normally, which is um, I twist the front. So just do a normal twist. Just grab the hair and just twist. It's super simple. And then I do this last, I don't know why, the front pieces. and you're just twisting it. And then you cross it over like this. 
and bobby pin it around the ponytail. And you might need to So that's what you're looking like. And I'm trying to get this tighter, a little bit tighter, but not too tight. Yeah. And then you go to the other side. So, one second. Okay, I'm on the other side. That did, that was better. And you just literally twist them. and then you wrap it around the other side. I'm using two bobby pins again. And then, so that's the, the beginning. And you can fluff it out or make it bigger um, if you want. Um, it just depends on how um, long your hair is. Cause you see that little piece is coming out. All you have to do is just tuck it. So your ends are tucked. Your ends are tucked. And then the only thing that I need to do is create a little bun like if your hair is a longer you can like roll it and tuck it um but yeah i'll just put it in this little ball you literally can pin it too um but that's it. I don't like a lot of pins in my hair. And so, yeah. And so with the edges, you can do your edges. Right now, I'm about to get in the shower. Um, again, like you see, this is coming out. You could just take a bobby pin. Again, like I said, your hair, um, if it's longer, it'll be different, but this is just a protective style. So your ends are protected, it's not tight at all. You can literally just put your uh, scarf on, fleek your edges, take it off. Um, it's not like hard to sleep in. You can slap your bonnet right back on, a red sleep get up do your edges if you want to you don't literally you don't have to do your edges um i think because it's later on in the day i'm about to take a shower and um so this is not gonna be i don't have to do my hair um but yeah this is a cute just regular style basically um you can put it in a ponytail or, or you can just roll and tuck it again so i'll show you the other roll and tuck another day but yeah this is my first roll and tuck protective style protective protective so excuse me the twists are protective in itself, but I'm going the extra mile to protect your ends. Like all of the ends are tucked. All of the ends are tucked. So um, 
leave a comment down below if you tuck your ends or are you wearing your twists out again these are chunky twists they look fine like i legit wore this style in the office granted i didn't put it in a ponytail first um but as your hair gets longer um you can do more styles with it um i saw a bunch of bunch of different styles that you could do with your twists um even your like single twist you don't have to know how to flat twist i tried to flat twist this weekend like two flat twists my hair so i have fine hair my hair is so thick and i think leave a comment down below if you have any tips on how to flat twist because it was just too much maybe i needed to uh, work on not damp hair but like um dry hair i don't know but i was just like i'm not doing this so that was the original plan that i was going to do some flat twists back like cornrows but Mm -mm. maybe I will practice on that some more but leave a comment down below if you've joined the hair challenge if not that's cool um, leave a comment down below if you would rock this out um, this protective protective style um, and please be sure to like comment and subscribe I will be getting to the store I will be getting to the store to get the aloe juice but um, yeah, that's it for today.